everyone. Welcome to the Monthly Review, the monthly show on language learning, where you discover new learning strategies, motivational tips, study tools, and resources. By the way, all the lessons and bonuses you're about to see can be downloaded for free on our website. So click the link in the description right now to sign up for your free lifetime account. Okay, today's topic is the easiest way to start writing and improve on your own. Are you learning a language on your own? If so, you might have wondered if you can actually improve by yourself and what kinds of things you can do when you don't have a teacher. Today you'll discover why writing is an easy way to learn a language, how to practice writing with our lessons on your own time, and how to get our free writing workbooks. Find these at the end. But first, listen up. Here are this month's new lessons and resources. First, the giving a speech cheat sheet. If you want to be able to give a speech about yourself and your target language, check out this cheat sheet. It'll give you all the must-know phrases. Second, the ultimate guide to beginner language. This ebook will teach you all the phrases a beginner needs to know. How to talk about family, how to talk about food, basic phrases, and much more. Third, words and phrases for HR and recruitment processes. If you want to talk about finding a job, or if you work in HR, then don't miss this one minute lesson. It'll teach you keywords and phrases essential to your goals. Fourth, how to talk about health problems. This one minute lesson will teach you important phrases that will help you express yourself when you're feeling sick. Fifth, top 20 words for negative emotions. If you want to be able to talk about your feelings, take a look at this lesson. You'll learn key words for negative emotions in just a few minutes. To get your free resources, click the link in the description below right now. They're yours to keep forever. Okay, let's jump into today's topic. The easiest way to start writing and improve on your own. Most language learners start with reading or speaking first. We all want to speak. Typically, most learners start their studies by reading textbooks or articles online. But writing? Not so many practice writing right away, unless the language has a unique writing system. There are a few reasons you should consider writing when you're learning a language. Let's jump into part one. One, why is writing an easy way to learn a language? So why is writing easy? First, you don't need anyone to start improving right now. When it comes to language learning, we all want feedback and corrections. And for that, we either need a teacher or a learning program that can quiz us. But if you want to improve on your own without waiting on anyone else, or if you don't have access to a teacher, you can start with writing. You'll find out how in just a minute. Second, you don't need to worry about what to write. How does this work? The easiest way to start writing is to copy text from somewhere else. That way, you don't have to worry about what to write or how to spell things. Just get a piece of paper and a pen and copy things from a resource you're using. You can even try doing this with your favorite quotes or ideas. Copy them word by word. Third, it can help you build a strong routine. Imagine you copy two sentences per day. It's simple and it just takes a minute or two. That means you can stick to it on a daily basis. And if you can learn to stick with that, you can stick to other learning routines in the future. And fourth, you'll end up improving all areas of the language. How? Well, if you're copying out a few sentences a day, you'll end up indirectly learning a lot of words, grammar rules, and lines you can actually use, simply because you're exposed to them. And if you read what you write, you'll improve your reading and comprehension skills too. So, how can you actually start writing in practice? Let's move on to part two. Part two, how to practice writing with our lessons on your own time. Number one, if you're taking our lessons, write out the phrases, sentences, and conversations by hand. This means writing every phrase and sentence that you learn in the lessons by hand in a notebook. You can also write out the conversations in the dialogue study tool, example sentences from the lesson notes, words and phrases from our vocabulary lists, and words and sentences from the Daily Dose app and the word of the day. Number two, write short sentences to your Premium Plus teacher. If you're a Premium Plus member, write a message and send it to your Premium Plus teacher for review. In fact, as a first step, all new Premium Plus users have to write a self-introduction and send it to their teachers. Your teacher will review your work, send feedback, corrections, and help you improve your writing skills fast. You can even write something out by hand, take a picture of it, and send it to your teacher. Number three, leave a comment on the lessons. 
After you're done with a lesson, be sure to use what you've learned, whether a new word or a grammar point. Leave a comment in the comment section, and our teachers will review it and give you feedback. Number four, dictation. This may be best for advanced learners. Dictation is a study method where you write down what you hear as a way to test your writing and listening skills. You can do this with any one of our audio or video lessons. Number five, create sentences using newly learned words. You can learn new words with our lessons, the word of the day, the vocab lists, and the core 2000 word list, which gives you the 2000 most frequently used words. And as mentioned before, you can also leave comments for our teachers to review. Number six, take the writing quizzes. With every lesson, you'll get review quizzes to help you master what you've learned. Just scroll down to the vocabulary section or click on vocabulary, then click on take a quiz. And that's it. Now you know how to improve your target language on your own. Just copy things out. And by the way, if you want our bonus free beginner level writing workbooks, leave a comment and we'll reply with the link. So thank you for watching this episode of Monthly Review. Next time we'll talk about 10 habits of highly effective language learners. If you enjoyed these tips, hit the like button, share the video with anyone who's trying to learn a language and subscribe to our channel. We release new videos every week. And if you're ready to finally learn language the fast, fun, and easy way and start speaking from your very first lesson, get our complete learning program. Sign up for your free lifetime account right now. Click the link in the description. See you next time. Bye.